What is parity? Parity is a simple form of error detecting method. A parity bit is added to a string of binary data, and it ensures that the number of ones in the data is odd or even. And depending on this we have two concepts of parity, odd parity, and even parity. Suppose, there is a transmitter. And here we have a receiver. We want to transmit a small string of data, say, 1101. But, we should also ensure that receiver receives the right data at its end. To make this happen, we use the concept of parity. In this, along with data, we also transmit one extra bit, known as a parity bit, that tells if the data has an odd or even number of ones. Here, we have an odd number of ones in the data. As mentioned before, there are two types of parity. Even parity and odd parity. Let us see an example of even parity first. In even parity, our objective is to maintain an even number of ones in the overall bit string. Here, in 1101 example, the number of ones in the data are 3, which is odd. To make the complete bit string even, we add a 1 as a parity bit. Now, the overall string has 4 ones, and it's an even number of ones. So we can say that, in the even parity method, if the data has an odd number of ones, then the corresponding parity bit is set as 1. If the data is 1100, which has an even number of ones, we would add 0 as a parity bit. Now, the complete bit string still has an even number of ones. So, we can say that, if the data has an even number of ones, then the corresponding parity bit will be set to 0. So in an even parity method, if the data has an odd number of ones, then the parity bit is set as 1, and if the data has an even number of ones, then the corresponding parity bit will be set to 0. But, how does the parity bit ensures the validity of data, received at the receiver's end? Here, the receiver will check the number of ones received in the data, and compare it with its corresponding parity bit. If the data has an odd number of ones, and the parity bit is 1, then the data is valid. If the data has an even number of ones, and the parity bit is 0, then the data received is valid. But suppose, a bit is flipped due to some noise, at the receiver's end. Then, in this case, the number of ones in the data becomes even. Now we know that, if we have an even number of ones in the data, then we set its parity bit as 0. But here, the receiver will find the parity bit set as 1. That means, the data received is corrupted. The receiver will send a request to the transmitter to retransmit this data. This is how even parity helps in checking the validity of the data. But what if two bits of data get flipped at the receiver's end? Can the parity bit be still used to check for data validity? Suppose in this 1101 data, two bits get flipped. It becomes 1011. The receiver will find the number of ones as odd in the data. We know that, in even parity, if the number of ones in the data is odd, then the parity bit is set to 1. The receiver will check the parity bit, and it will find it as set to 1. So, the receiver will consider the received data as valid data. Even though the transmitted data and received data are different. So, this tells us that, a parity bit can validate data only if there is a 1-bit change. If we have two or more bits changed at the receiver's end, then the parity bit validation fails. Let us quickly have a look at the odd parity. In odd parity, the objective is to have an odd number of ones in the overall bit string. Here, if the data has an even number of ones, then the corresponding parity bit is set to 1. The number of ones, in the overall bit string, becomes odd. If the data has an odd number of ones, then the corresponding parity bit is set to 0. This lets, the overall bit string, have an odd number of ones. The process of validating the received data is the same as explained in the even parity example. 
Just like it was in the even parity example, the odd parity also works if there is only a 1-bit change in the received data. If there are two or more changed bits then the odd parity also fails. So to summarize. Parity is a simple form of error detection. A parity bit added to data indicates if the data has an odd or even number of ones. There are two types of parity. Odd parity and even parity. In even parity, our objective is to maintain an even number of ones in the overall bit string. If the data has an odd number of ones, then we set its corresponding parity bit as 1. If the data has an even number of ones, then we set its corresponding parity bit as 0. In odd parity, our objective is to maintain an odd number of ones in the overall bit string. If the data has an even number of ones, then we set its corresponding parity bit as 1. If the data has an odd number of ones, then we set its corresponding parity bit as 0. Parity works only if there is a single bit change. But if two or more bits change, the parity fails. This is all a brief idea about parity. Thanks for your time and patience. Have a nice day.